Hello guys, it's me Z from Wireless Solution and today we are going to go, uh, do the Google Bypass on uh, the new Sam's uh, Motorola G Stylus <coughs> or all new Motorola that has the software version of Android 10Q so what we are going to do here is uh, first let me show you that the Google is locked and uh, <coughs> so you will need to connect to Wi-Fi okay it will take a few moments mm. i'm trying to make videos of our google bypass on all new phones so i will be uploading them step by step like uh, aristo 5 lg aristo 5 and uh, samsung galaxy s21 um, stylo 6 and stylo 5 uh, i already make it on that one it's already uploaded uh, LG K51 is uploaded <coughs> so now you can see that this device was reset to continue you need to sign it with the same Gmail so you need to go back um, first select the language then go down make sure this is the language you need to select once you click on this one click any one of that then go to the uh, emergency call click on this one and you need to click on here one time and then the second time once you are here you can see the edit sign you click on that one then click here and then once you come here you can see the uh, google web sign you press and hold it and click on this one <coughs> once you are here what we are going to do is to add another language so select a random language from there hit ok then add another language select another language and hit ok now just to be just done to do that you need to go back once we go back you can change the language to english so we know what we are doing click on emergency call emergency information click on that one again edit sign aid language once we add language over here you need to click here you can see the <coughs> uh, web browser sign so press and hold it once you so you can see add language once you click on add language add keyboard then go down you will find a language that has an arrow sign in front of it click on this one once you click on this one you will come to these three option uh, click on these three dots and help and feedback once we are in help and feedback you can see about switch access of for android you click on here and then tap this uh, small youtube video will be playing once you s click on this one you can see these three dots on the upper right corner click on this one and watch later it will open a chrome for you accept and continue no thanks so from here what we are going to do is uh, click on here so we are going to if your chain language is being changed so click on the web sign it will back it to English so now we are going to type B I T dot <coughs> L Y B I T dot L Y forward slash L A U N C H E R launcher underscore a P E X new this is what you are looking for so click on this one once you click on this one you will hit download <coughs> then hit OK so you can see you can see from here the open sign or if you cannot find it from here you can go here go to download you can go to the three dots go to download and you can open it from there once you hit open so go to setting turn this one on go back and install once you do that then hit open and then continue so now you we are here so what we are going to do here 
is click on the Chrome once you click on the Chrome we are going to download other two software that will be bit.ly forward slash frp underscore Google you can see this one once you click on this one hit download and press OK and then open once you open you hit install and done there is another software we are going to download is bit.ly frp underscore bypass so once you hit search for this one okay bit dot ly forward slash frp underscore bypass this is what we are going the third one will be then hit download once you download click ok and open once you open install and open once it open from here click on here browsing sign in ok so here you are going to create uh, log in with your new gmail so let me log in with mine Okay, I log in with mine. Now we are going to put the password in. And then sign in. Okay, so now what you are going to do is click on the click on this four and just swipe the screen towards your left and then go back. why it took me all the way out okay so let's do it again go to of course the chrome and once you are here come to download because we already downloaded that one so click on the third one open now once we are here what we are going to do you can go to the setting inside the setting we can go back you go down security and thing then you can see device administration app admin app turn this one on now we are going to go back now once you go back to this screen what you are going to do is hit back we are going to click on chrome again and once you are on chrome here you will say find my device and find my device Google click on this one so now log in with the same Gmail the new one you have and now then hit the password the password you already created for your new one now i already logged in save never dismiss
so now once this is completed click on this one now what you can see is a secure device so you will put a password let me put zero 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 and that is gonna be next make sure remember the password okay now recovery option the message you want to say is like you can type anything i'll just type florida and phone number you can type is just one two three four five six seven eight nine Okay, so it will be one, two, three. Okay, just make sure it's equal to the phone numbers. Now you can see the device is locked. Once you once you swipe it back, we put the password as zero 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 zero. Hit next okay now what you are going to do is erase device click on this one erase device now again you are going to log into the gmail that you already created the new one now i'm going to put the password okay erase and it will be factory data reset <coughs> it will take a few moments the phone will be completely erased then now once it's restarted so remember we make the new pin as zero 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 Uh, and i really appreciate your comments i really appreciate you guys are watching the video and subscribing the channel thank you so much guys <clears throat> i'm trying my best if there is any problem or any new phones you guys have uh, sometime i don't have the phone and you want me to make a video so i think i'm going to start a new thing that you can send me the phone mail it to me i will unlock it and if you guys want i can send it back if you are inside united state but the shipment you are going you guys are going to pay for it now <clears throat> um It will take a few moments for this to start up. Now you select the next button. Uh, just skip. Make sure here you are connected to a Wi-Fi. It's gonna take a few moments <coughs> to 
bypass the check the updates and then you will see you guys will see that uh, the new password we put at zero zero <coughs> so we are going to use that as a verification and once you hit next so now you don't need to verify the google verification see so now you can just hit next skip Just skip this and hit OK. Accept and continue. Allow all the time. Get started. Next, next, next. Gonna be done. So now, one last thing we are going to do is uh, just swipe down go to setting and here type reset so erase all data factory reset erase data and now erase all data and boom your phone is completed thank you guys have a nice one see you next video